good afternoon students welcome to your today's chapter briefing session for the chapter that we had completed in our online session the name of the chapter chapter number 5 the mouth beginning with today's session as we had studied about the different parts of the computer like monitor which display the output or the working which you are doing on the computer it's the screen on which you can see what work you are doing it's monitor cpu that is central processing unit which is the brain of the computer all the processing work we perform by cpu in the previous chapter we had talked about we had learned about keyboard consisting different keys and every key or each type of key has their uh, particular use like to type alphabets we have alphabetic key to type numbers we have numeric key to give blank spaces we have space bar in the same context we are going to talk about the another important device of the computer that is mouse mouse is also known as a pointing device i would like to sh uh, sh uh, sh uh, show you a mouse this is the small device which we are talking about mouse it's very really small which is being connected to the computer or you can say to the cpu with the help of this wire nowadays in market we can also get the mouse without wire that are wireless mouse but traditional or the normal mouse has a wire which is connected to the cpu now what is the use of this mouse what is the use of this small device as you have all have seen that on your computer screen we have a pointer or a arrow sign which is moving over the screen on different icons on different on different parts of the screen this arrow sign is known as pointer it is known as pointer or mouse pointer so this mouse pointer is being controlled by the use of mouse up mouse by using this mouse we control this pointer hum is mouse ka use karke pointer ko control karte hain if we move our mouse towards the left direction the pointer will go towards the left if we are moving our mouse towards the right the pointer will go towards the right if we are moving our mouse towards up the pointer will go up and similarly it's going down so means as the mouse will move as the movement of mouse the pointer on the screen will also move so mouse is a pointing device which is used to control the pointer or the mouse pointer after that you all have seen that we use generally we use mouse on a smooth surface like a table but the proper use of mouse is over or to properly use a mouse we may require a small piece of text cloth like this this piece of cloth which is being generally used to place the mouse this piece of cloth is known as mouse pad now mouse pad is being used so that your mouse could receive a smooth surface and on this smooth surface the mouse can easily move and the movement will be detected by the pointer and the pointer will also move according to that sometimes aapne dekha hoga if the surface is not not smooth if it's a rough surface and you don't have a mouse pad aap mouse move karte reh jate hain but pointer uske according move nahi karta because the surface jahan pe aapne mouse ko rakha hai it's not smooth it's rough and on that the mouse is not moving properly so mouse ke proper movement ke liye we require a small piece of cloth like this and this is known as mouse pad so mouse pad is being used to keep your mouse and to use your mouse smoothly after that comes the next part how you will hold the mouse generally we have a left hander who rise with the left hand and we have a right hander whether we are a left hander or we are a right hander for holding the mouse will require three fingers 
only three fingers thumb index finger that is your first finger and middle finger that is your second finger okay we require three fingers thumb index finger and middle finger rest will not require so as in the class i had shown you <coughs> that our mouse consists of two buttons as everybody know and we have already named the buttons also the first button is on the left side which is your left button and the other button is on the right side which is known as right button along with these two button the mouse has a scroll wheel so we were talking about holding the mouse so we have to keep in mind that our thumb will be on the side of the mouse our index finger first finger will be on the left button and our middle finger will be on the right button this is how we hold the mouse if we are lefty then also our index finger on the left button our middle finger on the right button and we will hold the mouse i'll just show you in the practical this is the mouse i am a right hander so my index finger on the left button my middle finger on the right button and my thumb on the side this is how the right handers will hold the mouse for the left handers my middle finger sorry my index finger on the left button the next on the right and this is how i hold the mouse okay so this is how we hold the mouse so after holding the mouse we have the last topic that is regarding the action what are the actions what are the tasks that we can perform by using the mouse the two tasks which are being described in your chapter is one is left click and the next one is double click left click when we press the left button of the mouse for one tap when we press the left button of the mouse for one time it is known as click or is a short form mein hum sirf click bhi bolte hain left click is also known as click by the left click left click means jab aap mouse ke button ko one time press karte hain normally we select or choose the file or program hum files ya programs ko select ya choose kar sakte hain just by having a left click on that file or folder by using the mouse double click when you press the left button of the mouse two times jab aap mouse ke left button ko do baar press karte hain do baar press karte hain it is known as double click generally by double click we open or start a program agar hum kisi file ya folder pe ya kisi program pe hum double click karte hain by using the mouse the file or folder will get open or the program will get start these are the two actions which are being taught by using the mouse during today's class and this makes your chapter explanation video complete for today after this i would be sharing the chapter reading session along with the exercise for today thank you take care